Hey, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the shop. Things are getting crazy because summertime is here and it's full throttle everywhere. Still got to get to the 90 CRX over here. I actually haven't even touched it. Uh, it still needs door panels and everything put back into it, but we'll get to that. And of course, we'll get to that. And there's a windshield going in this today, and hopefully, you guys will get to see that. We're going to go check in with Road Racing and Mad Boost Mart and see what's going on with Bell Nova today. Welcome back out to the Road Racing Shop. There's spare parts. One day we'll get back to that. We're going to be racing this weekend, so we got to get Bell Nova out of the shop, off the stands, loaded up in the box. in here AC isn't working uh, I'll work on that later hit the track today kds it is a beautiful day out here just pulled up gonna start unloading unhooking and get everything warmed up and ready for time trials i made it out to the track today too and we're gonna get to see bell nova run Guys, I don't know how many times we've seen this car on the channel, but today is finally the day we're gonna go test and tune with it. The Torque Storm Supercharger is on that Mad Boost Marcus put on it. I'm sure you guys saw that episode. If you haven't, go back and check it out. But today is finally the day when the car gets to run. Check it out, even Buddha showed up. Look. What's up, buddy?
Took a little test of the return lane there just to see if everything was running good, and it's not, but that's why you do that to make sure everything's running good. It's actually the front left brake calipers locking up or something stuck, so I'm gonna check that out and see if we can get it fixed. I'll see what's going on. Well, I'm not exactly sure what happened, but there's definitely some movement in that brake caliper under there, so I'm gonna take the wheel off, figure out what's going on, and then put it back together. Yeah, no, I just gotta get the process. Oh, yeah, he was See that, that bolt right there is backed out. what it is is a bolt that's back down the back of the caliper it's making it a little bit loose it's causing a little bit of squeak and it definitely caused the brake caliper not to work now that everything's got wd-40 on it it's nice and slick <laughs> doesn't like working out in the grass can you see in there now that bolt That bolt is definitely rubbed right there. Hopefully we'll just tighten that up, take another test hit, and then we'll get it out on the track. It was grinding the nut down. See what I did wrong, guys. Show y'all. See them tabs? I never bent them. That's why I did it. That's why I backed out, yeah. I put them on, it's my fault. <laughs> Guess what? You blew it! <laughs> <laughs> yep, he did. Like I said, it looks like a pretty simple fix. The mark is on it, got it all put back together. These cars are quiet down, you can hear me. What an incredible ride, man. That was exhilarating. I can't wait to just watch it go down the track. Let's hope we get some good time. Six eight, what? Six eight seven? Six eight six. Six eight six. Hey, ready to go, man? Woo! Way to go.
go. So far, that's the fastest that car has ever been, and that was just to test it to see how it's gonna do. Can't wait till it's really dialed in. 686 at 152.3. Terrible reaction, but won't even try. What First rip, six man. off my back, finally. Way to finally. go. Way to go. Finally. What a relief, guys. I have been trying for a few years now to get a six second pass. And I know that's not that fast to some people. There's four second cars, there's five second cars, hell, there's three second cars. 686 at 100 mile an hour out of that bracket car right there felt great. There's more in it. I feel it. That was the only time trial we get for today. We're dialing into the rest of the day. I'm just so pumped. Like I said, three years I've been trying to get this supercharger right, fighting carburetor problems. Here it is today, the six ticket oh man i'm just I, the day is a win a success i'm glad y'all were here it's bracket racing today so we got to write the time on the car 686 Six, first pass 686 right so i turned it up a smidge only i'm gonna put a 680 on it and hope for the best Mark's got 680 on the car and that means he has to run a 680 or slower he can't go any faster if he goes any faster that's breaking out but he should run 680 and he should cross the finish line exact same time as the guy, whoever it is, that lines up beside him. So we'll just be cheering for him to get to the finish line first and not go faster than 680. There it is, let's take it up to the line, see what we can get this time. in the stage of things and you can see who we're going against and there's Mark's car right over there yeah let me point it out right and he has to race this rail car right here and it is bracket so we're just hoping for the best yep. good luck buddy ran a 6.9 something and that was a little bit slower than what he had dialed in didn't matter anyway the rail car was faster but he bought back in so we're still in the race so we're gonna give it another shot 9 something right here. Yeah, 6, 9, oh, I had to pedal it uh, it was wiggling around you can see it in the video real bad where it, where it jumps to the right just a little bit um, here I'll show you so I, ped so I pedaled it yeah. and it ran 694 so I'm gonna put a 690 on it not worry about it really just get another time run Maybe that'll give him just a little bit more room so he can kind of let off at the end and take the win. We'll see.
last time Mark went out, he went in against a rail car. And it looks like he's doing it again. You can see on this rail car over here, let's check out the time he's got dialed. Uh, I know you guys know Mark's got a, a 690 on here. And this car is dialing 499. So he's going to be coming fast for Mark. So he's going to have to get it. really fast and it ran him down and it took the win but that's all right because mark did another six second run that locks this car in as a six second race car pretty sick right, so this was our fastest ever on motor oh, yeah, 7 46 and 89 miles an hour maybe it had been and that was before you put the torch on right right so now 686 with a 7 and a 686 with a o so the car likes 86 as fast as that car has been. <laughs> so we can pump. This is not the fastest times anybody's ever run, but the fastest times that that car's ever run. So it's really exciting for us. track i'm sorry it was so hard for me to do but there you go we're just super excited today i gotta thank b for coming out today mom dad as always i mean i got so many people i could thank you guys thank y'all for tuning in to do until the next one. Stay mad! People staring at me, talking to myself on the phone. Uh, shit, I don't want to say that. I call that a successful day. Thanks for watching.